Preparing to welcome some of the superstars of the English Premier League. For a few hours at least, Pretoria appeared to be mainly covered in the sky blue of Manchester City. But that felt eerily strange, given the English side were up against South African team Supersport United. We love Manchester City, it's a big team. And uh, we also like Supersport, but today, yeah, the best one is going to win, but it's going to be Manchester City. First of all, I love uh, United Kingdom, and I really feel comfortable with that team. I love them. I, they are strong. They are, I don't know how to say that, but I love them. That's why I'm supporting them. And the club themselves appear delighted to be kicking off their pre-season in South Africa. Yeah, fantastic. Lovely country, lovely people. Good Take stuff. care. Enjoy. City are here not just to get match fit for the new season and improve their global brand, but to also help promote Mandela Day. And this tour comes with the backing of Ndaba Mandela, Nelson Mandela's grandson. Through this set of games, we're really trying to make people aware about the importance of Mandela Day. Mandela Day is all about giving back to your community. Uh, so we're asking the public to basically give 67 minutes of their time to doing something good for their community. So whether it be doing a little community service, cleaning up your street, or going to see an orphanage, or playing with um, kids at an aid hospice, uh, those are the kind of things that we want people to do. You know, give back to your community, clean up your local school, and, and just be one with the community. As for the match itself, South Africa Super Sport United promised to provide the visitors with a stern test. This is, after all, a team that have won three league titles of their own in the last six years. And so it proved, with Supersport United winning the match 2-0. This is my first match, as you say, but it's very important and very in honour for us to play here in such important day as the, the birthday of, of Mr Mandela. So for, for Manchester City, and for me, it's, it's an honour to, to participate here. We are just starting the season, so we are not. It's always important to win, but for us, it's more important to to give minutes to the whole squad. But one thing was clear: the visitors' performance did nothing to dampen the locals' enthusiasm for all things Man City, and in particular, Cote d'Ivoire's Yaya Toure. So the first leg of Manchester City's tour to Africa ends in defeat. It may well have just been a pre-season friendly, but the delight for Supersport United was clear. The question now, can Amazulu make it a South Africa double on Thursday? Dan Williams, CCTV in Pretoria, South Africa.